I'm just heading back to the room um, from getting breakfast and yeah, I'm gonna go get ready. Uh, I'm doing Madeline today. So, I still don't have any chill. Um, Linda pa Valentine, the voice actor for Sailor Moon, kind of gave me a hug. I have no chill at all. Um, it just kind of is settling in. Um, and uh, the voice actor for Tuxedo Mask also called me a meatball head, and I have a recording of that. So, yes, this, this is my, my beautiful, beautiful life right now of having absolutely no chill. Um, right now I'm just kind of wandering the convention. Um, the lighting in here is horrible. I also got a picture with uh, AJ Fry, so no chill, no chill. There is no chill. Talk to you guys later. Okay, so obviously this costume is much more uh, popular than Toru, but I prefer Toru. She's, she's my bae, man. So anyway, bye. <laughs> um, yeah, this is my life today. Just hanging around, walking around. There's the vendors area. It's just, just really good focus. So I came came upstairs to get food, but there's not much for vegetarians. So I'm gonna go to the food court. Um, yeah. Um, that's my life right now. Just walking around, elevators. Um, I'm meeting uh, the actress who plays uh, Tonks in Harry Potter around 12.30 uh, for an autograph. And yeah, it's the time. Um, people are loving the hair. Like, seriously, this hair is awesome. It's really warm though. And yeah, someone recognized me as uh, the character that I am, so that's always fun. Um, and yeah, I took a picture with uh, the white hair, so that will be on my uh, Facebook page. Anyway, I'll talk to you guys a little bit more. So I kind of ended up lost. The, uh, the escalator wasn't working, so I decided to go outside and walk around. Bad life choices were made. So, I'm now outside cold and walking back to the convention because I want food. And yeah, I want food but not bad enough. Not bad enough to eat meat at the convention because uh, that's all that there is. There's only like donuts and burgers and stuff. Um, and yeah, just going back to the convention I'm going from there because apparently I got lost and the lighting is going to change there we go look it's a Halcon sign so yep let's find some food this food moment is brought to you by Ethan Hortons cheese panini the only thing that I really eat at conventions because I'm a pescatarian and there's never anything that I can eat. So, there's usually a Tim's nearby. So, it works. So, I had a picture with AJ Fry earlier and I'm gonna go get an autograph because I can and it's free. And I have a warp speed password on the way. So, yeah. Um, and I'm probably going to be doing a picture with uh, ALB and I'm going to see if the Sailor Moon Google will take a picture of me because I was kind of hugged and I kind of really want, want to take a picture with them so who knows, who knows what will happen so all I am is hair <laughs> I'm just like oh, awesome hair I'm just hair so uh, there was someone who recognized me from the uh, Monster High, Ever After High universe. Um, couldn't quite put their uh, their finger on who I was, but yeah, I've been having an awesome time. Um, and 
Yeah, it should be okay. Just gotta wait for it to dry. Okay. And yeah, so I'm heading back to the, uh, the hotel room for a little bit. Uh, I'm gonna drop off my autographs and such. Um, because I'm currently just walking around with them. Um, yeah. Um, yeah. I reached that point of my feet hurt. Oh um, so, next I am going to be going to a Q&A with uh, the Sailor Moon voice actors of the Valentine, Valentine and uh, Toby Proctor and uh, that's in a couple hours and then I will be going I think I have something else that I want to do then. I don't know. And then there's the, uh, uh what's it called? The, the staircase, there's a soiree where we, we just mingle. We get to mingle. So that's always fun. And yeah. So I have the rest of my day planned. And I will see you guys probably later. <laughs> You know why I think she was a strong female character? That's like, that's a good question. No one's ever asked me that. I think it's because she did let herself be herself. She was not afraid to make mistakes. And I think that that is, there is so much strength in that on its own. Oh my God, I'm going to get misty thinking about this. I, but I just, I love the fact that she could fall down and she, she, she made big time mistakes, big time, but she'd pick herself up and keep going. And I love that. I love it. So that's why I think she was a strong woman. Okay. Flawed. <laughs> had a favorite character in the series. Like I know you both play like Sailor Moon and Tuxedo Mask. Whose was yours, Toby? <laughs> <laughs> well, Linda, person I'll probably travel with very soon. Um, you know, Sailor Moon, obviously she's the really? lead. Yes. Wow. I usually say Sailor Mars just to bug her. <laughs> but she's she almost near tears. I thought, maybe we can get her to tears. No. <laughs> yeah, you know, it's Sailor Moon. It's an amazing character. And, and like you said, it, and I have daughters too, and I love the fact that there's some role models, strong, and, but different, and a, uh, not perfect. You know, I think being, uh, being a strong uh, anything isn't necessarily being one thing constantly. It's, it's being... Being able to have have like what you were just saying, just being human, and I think that was the element, and I think Sailor Moon enjoys that. So I actually love Sailor Mars too. I love Jupes and Mars, but I love Mars because I love the fact that she always called Serena out on stuff, and she used to be like, "Are you kidding me?" And she was just like, "What?" That's why they got in so many arguments. So for my money, they were they were best friends as far as I was concerned, because they just they could tell each other anything. And they did. <laughs> Although a few of the villains were pretty cool too. <laughs> Hi guys. So uh, we're nearing the end of uh, Saturday. I've changed my lipstick uh, actually to the original color that I got for Madman. Um, I prefer it to the uh, to the pur purple, honestly. And um, I ate, so I figured I would just change it. Um, but yeah, no, it's. Uh, it's been a, a very interesting day. Everyone loves the hair. Um, someone asked me if it was the same wig as I had at Capital Cosplay. Yes, yes it is. Um, and yeah. Uh, I ate the, um, the Delta Halifax has a special menu. I like their $10 lunch menu that is available uh, all day for people who are um, attending Halcon. So they have the Lunar, Luna's Salmon uh, Pasta. It was really good. It had like spinach and a Dijon cream sauce. It was delicious. Um, but yeah, no, so this is my life right now. Um, I'm currently just waiting for the Stargazer Soiree to start. And yeah. Um, yeah, the, uh, the panel, the Q&A was awesome. Um, I just love the energy that, uh, 
that uh, Toby and Linda have together, like, when, when they're on stage together, um, they're, like, constantly laughing and making jokes and just, they're both so funny to just listen to. Um, like, that panel could have gone on for another two hours and I would not have minded. Um, and yeah, so I will be going to the soiree. Sadly, there's no video in the soiree, so I won't be able to have any clips. Um, there's no pictures or videos, so... Oh well. I might have some pictures, like apparently last year there was a picture area, so I might have some from there. Um, and tomorrow I am going to try to get a, like, a video, just like, or a picture with, uh, Linda and Toby because, excuse me, because that would be nice to have. Um, I'm just going to actually reach over here and show you guys what I got. Um, so I got this signed by uh, Natalia Tena, uh, and it says, Dear Marie, don't call me Nymphadora. Um, and then I got my picture taken with uh, AJ Fry, and he, he says, uh, see you in the future, and has a little awesome little drawing there. Um, the, I love the, how my, my wig like pops in this picture, like, it's awesome. Um, and then for... Um, Toby and Linda, I actually got, um, actually a duplicate of Tuxedo Mask because I'm that person that does take these out of their boxes, um, because, like, yeah, sure, they're collectibles, but I'm not going to be selling them anytime soon. I have no desire to sell them, so I'm going to keep them, and they're going to they're gonna be out of their box. Uh, so I did buy a, uh, a duplicate of Tuxedo Mask and it has been signed. Um, and then I found the uh, the one with the wand. I was so excited that I found this uh, on the vendor's floor. Like, you have no clue. And it says on the top, uh, to Marie, in the name of the moon, uh, Sailor Moon, <laughs> with a little drawing there. And it's signed in pink. It is awesome. So I had a, a good day. Uh, I still have uh, a photo op with uh, Natalia Tena tomorrow, and I will be Regina tomorrow, so I don't know, I don't know why I didn't, I don't know, I didn't know how well this, this costume was going to turn out because I've never worn everything together, so I think I did it specifically like Regina on the last day because she's simple, one, two, it's more like it's the costume that I'm most comfortable with because I know it, um, whereas this one I'm still kind of discovering. So anyway, I think people are coming back, so I will see you guys later. Okay y'all, so it is now like some like 10 o'clock, um, everyone else has gone to Dorks and Dungeons. I, on the other hand, am tired and have some schoolwork that I do need to do, so I'm going to probably take a shower. I might go to the pool, I don't know. Probably not, but I might. Um, and yeah. So this is the end of day two of Halcon. Tomorrow's the last day. But I will be Regina tomorrow, so I will be in my element. So, yes, I will see you guys then. Bye.